and I'll be demonstrating an open chain exercise. The exercise that I've chosen is a jump squat. The muscles contracted during a jump squat are your hamstrings and your quadriceps as well as your gluteus maximus. Um, also the correct technique during this exercise, you sh your feet should be shoulder width apart and your feet should also be um, slightly outwards to prevent friction at your knee joints which is your hinge joint. Also, the reason why this is an open chain exercise is because your feet and your hands aren't locked um, during the exercise. Now I'll be demonstrating how to do a jump squat. So as I said, feet are shoulder width apart. Feet should be slightly outwards. And now I'll start in this position. I'll put my feet, I'll put my hands right ahead. Like this. Now my hands are ahead of me for support and balance so that I don't get off balance. Thank you. Now for my closed chain exercise I've chosen a leg extension. Um, the reason why it's a closed chain is because your hands and your feet are fixed upon the position because it's used for support of the movement. Um, your feet cannot move unless it's used to um, work out of different muscles if it's pointed outwards or inwards which will if it's pointed outwards to the outside like this it will mean that um, it works the inside which is the inside of your your rectus femoris and um, if it's if it's pointing towards each other it works the outside um, which is your lateralis of the um, rectus femoris. Now um, the muscles contracted of course is your quadriceps and during this exercise your hands and your feet need to be fixed to allow for stability of the movement. Your knees, to be, your knees need to be locked during this to, um, to have support and the cushions need to be on your tibula to prevent any, any further injuries and as well on, on your knees. Um, now the reason why I said it's a closed, it's a closed, um, closed chain exercise again, it's because your feet and your hands are fixed. Now I'll be demonstrating the movement. So this is the cushion here that protects the lower tibula. Now my hands will be fixed on this structure here, and I'll go up and I'll hold it for a few seconds. And I'll come down. So this contracts your the whole of your quadriceps. Now if I point my feet outwards, outwards it works the inside, which is the um, third um, and if I point it out um, inwards it works the outside, which is the lateralis, and this is the medialis.